uh, uh, two servants of God, blessed servants of God with us this morning, attending and joining with us in this uh, uh, service. Uh, the first one is uh, you, maybe all of you, some of, um, most of you will be knowing our uh, uh, dear pastor, Thomas Abraham and uh, Andy. Uh, we welcome you. Uh, uh, we call him as a present pastor and uh, we are so glad to have uh, Pastor Thomas Abraham and Andy with us. Uh, you know, uh, he is the pioneer uh, minister of our church and we love you, Pastor, and we, we have been praying for you. And, uh, uh, you know, we were, I mean, we were knowing that uh, you were going through the tough situation. We, we were praying for you and we love you and you are well familiar with our people. And uh, uh, we just want to hear from you this morning. And uh, uh, now uh, Pastor Thomas uh, Abraham will uh, share, share a few, I mean, encouraging words with us. And uh, then he'll be praying and he'll be doing the blessing prayer. Uh, for the for for our church and uh, that this is the time for uh, uh, Pastor uh, Thomas Abraham and then after that uh, we'll be having a guest speaker also uh, that is Pastor I mean uh, Joseph Matthew and uh, uh, now uh, Pastor Thomas Abraham will speak to us and we, he'll be praying for us. Let's see prayer. Thank you, Pastor, and thank you, friends in California. Uh, we are very happy to join you. Our family of God uh, uh, in uh, Folsom, Sacramento, uh, Sacramento uh, and uh, are happy to join you. Uh, uh, the world around there is uh, this sickness going on and a lot of people are dying and uh, but thank God that we are alive. Jesus is alive and, and he is not only the savior, he is the healer and he is the mighty uh, uh, worker. And I, I just want to take a, a minute or two here to just uh, uh, thank you for uh, uh, the, the way that uh, uh, you were uh, uh, with us uh, uh, when we, we had uh, uh, the responsibility of the church. And uh, uh, good to see the, your new pastor and, and his family and uh, the uh, they, they, they are blessed of the Lord, and may the Lord bless uh, the eternal Church of God. Uh, yeah, like and, and eternal Church of God uh, uh, in Sacramento. Uh, I'm just going to read uh, five verses uh, from the scripture. There is no preaching, uh, since you have a, a, a minister who, who will be preaching uh, uh, today. I am going to read five verses from uh, uh, Psalm number 34. I will uh, bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. My soul shall make her boast in the Lord. The humble shall uh, hear thereof and be glad. Oh, magnify the Lord with me and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord, and he heard me and delivered me from all my fears. Uh, uh, dear friends, as, as the whole world is, is under the fear of this corona virus, uh, we are not fearful. We, we, we can magnify the Lord because the, the, he is with us. My uh, soul, soul shall make her boast in the Lord. That's a powerful English word. Uh, the humble shall we 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 are humble at the uh, same time we are boasters of the Lord Jesus Christ, and uh, therefore we can magnify the Lord uh, uh, together and uh, uh, we, and he, he, he and his uh, uh, his name uh, uh, magnify his name together. Uh, this is a day that we can seek the Lord and we can find Him. I sought the Lord and He heard me. Yes. He is a, a Lord who will uh, hear the crying of his children and deliver uh, me from all my fears. Dear, dear friends, I want you to know that uh, in spite of this coronavirus uh, worldwide, uh, we don't have to be afraid because he is our Lord. The word fear not is, three, is mentioned 365 times in the Holy Scriptures. One fear not for each 
they show we, we will not fear and thank you pastor for your congregation and for your good leadership and may the lord uh, bless you eternally thank you very much would you please pray for us pastor our father and our god we thank you because you are our heavenly father lord the world is going through such an agony uh, and and the fear and sickness but, but we can call our heavenly father who hear us today lord jesus we hear we we pray today for those who are uh, in uh, under tyranny for those who are going through this coronavirus in the name of jesus let this be a day of victory and healing there is healing in the name Amen. of jesus hallelujah thank you dear lord thank you thank you we bless your wonderful name we pray uh, for the church in california the church that joins us uh the the, the, the church of god uh, uh, the church of god church and i i pray that you will bless the pastor and his wonderful family and all the members there lord let the church of god uh, be able to shine in that part of the country and we bless you because you are in charge of the church we thank you the lord you are worthy of our praise and we praise you and we give you honor in jesus name we pray amen, amen. and amen praise god praise god thank you pastor glen andy god bless you and we love you uh and auntie you would like to share something yes um the today is our 58th wedding anniversary oh, and God, i God. am so happy that to join you all for the 58 years of happy married life and we were in Folsom and in sacramento with you all during our 52nd anniversary i think it was in 2014 and uh, i mean 19 <laughs> when was it 14 yeah anyway um Oh, so goodness. God has been so good to us and we will bless the Lord at all time, even good times and bad times. And my, thank you so much for praying for my husband. He has been ill for about one year. And this is the first time he is uh, speaking in a church service, uh, even praying in a church service in one year. So that's a miracle of God. And thank you for Hallelujah. praying. And can please continue praying for us. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Happy anniversary, Uncle and Andy. God bless you. And uh, we'll be continuously praying for you and uh, your family and your uh, ministry. May God bless you. And uh, today we have uh, uh, Pastor.